Here's our Phrygian scale or our Phrygian mode throughout the whole neck using our cage scale shapes as a way to kind of anchor them to our chord shapes. Now the Phrygian mode is just like my minor scale, only we also flat the two. So this is going to be uh, kind of using our major scale as a frame of reference. My one, flat two, flat three, four, five, flat six, flat seven, and back to our one again. Now I'm going to be using the key of D as my example today. So my first shape, which is my C minor shape, is going to be, my root note is going to be on the fifth string, fifth fret. So first I'm going to pinky on the root note, fifth string, fifth fret, and then the fourth string, I'm going to be going first fret, third fret, fifth fret, and the third string, I'm going to be going second, third, fifth fret. And the second string, I'm going to be going third fret, fourth fret, and on the first string, I'm going to be going first, third, fifth. All right, so there it is, kind of ascending right there. I'm now I'm going to go backwards, so 5th fret, 3rd fret, 1st fret on the 1st string, 4th, 3rd on the 2nd string, 5th, 3rd, 2nd on the 3rd string, 5th, 3rd, 1st on the 4th string, back to my root note. Now before my root note, I can play on the 5th string, 3rd fret, 1st fret, 5th fret on the 6th string, 3rd, 1st, and I want to walk my way back up. I always like to start and end on my root note. My A minor alt shape is going to be with my second finger on the fifth string, fifth fret, and my third finger is going to be going to my flat two, which is going to be on the sixth fret, fifth string. My first finger is going to be going down to the fourth string, third fret, fifth, and then seventh fret. First finger is going to go down to the third string, third fret, fifth fret, and then seventh fret. It's going to be my first finger on the fourth fret, second string, third fret, uh, third finger on the sixth fret, uh, second string. Then on my first string, it's going to be 3rd fret, 5th fret, 6th fret. Now, after that, I'm going to just reverse all that. 5th on the 1st string, 3rd, 6th, 4th on the 2nd string, 7th, 5th, 3rd on the 3rd string, 7th, 5th, 3rd on the 4th uh, string, 6th, 5th on my 5th uh, string to go back to my root note. And I'm going to be going down below that. So my third fret on the fifth string, sixth, fifth, third on the uh, sixth string, and I'm going to walk my way back up. You know, I always want to start and end on the root note. Now my a shape is I'm going to be starting out from the fifth string, fifth fret again. My first finger is going to go on that root note now, and then I'm going to be going uh, fifth fret, sixth fret, eighth fret, and then on the next, on the fourth string, I'm going to be going fifth, seventh, eighth, and then fifth, seventh, eighth again, and then I'm going to be going to my sixth fret on my second string, eighth fret on my second string, fifth, sixth, eighth on my first string. Now I'm going to be going backwards by going 8th, 6th, 5th, 8th, 6th, 8th, 7th, 5th on the 3rd string, 8th, 7th, 5th on the 4th string, 8th, 6th, 5th fret on the 5th string, and below that I'm going to be going 8th, 6th, 5th again. And I'm going to walk back up to the root note. My G shape is going to start out on the 10th fret, 6th string, put my pinky on that, and then I'm going to be going 10th fret, on the 5th fret, on the 5th string, I'm going to be going 6, 8, 10, and then 7, 8, 10 on the 4th string, 7, 8, 10 on the 3rd string, that's 10th fret on the 6th string, 6, 8, 10, and then 7, 8, 10, 7, 8, 10, both on the 4th and the 3rd string, then 8, 10 on the second string, and then 6, 8, 10 on the first string. Now to go backwards, I'm going to hang out right there at the 10th fret, first string, 
Go backwards, 10, 8, 6. On the second string, 10, 8. On the third string, 10, 8, 7. 10, 8, 7 on the fourth string. 10, 8, 6 on the fifth string. Right there, back to my original spot. I'm going to be going backwards to the eighth fret, then the sixth fret, and walk back up to the tenth fret where my root note is. Again, always start and end on the root note. The E minor alt shape is going to be with my second finger on the root note on the sixth string. I'm going to be going 10, 11 on the sixth string, and then 8, 10, 11 on the fifth string. 8, 10, oh, I'm sorry, 8, 10, 12 on the 5th string, 8, 10, 12 on the 4th string, 8, 10, 8th fret to the 10th fret on the 3rd string, 8, 10, 11 on the 2nd string, 8, 10, 11, that's, I'm going to go backwards, 11, 10, 8, 11, 10, 8, that's on the 1st string, and on the 2nd string, 10, 8 on the 3rd string, 12, 10, 8, 12, 10, 8, on the both the fourth string and the fifth string, and then 11, 10 on the sixth string, back to the eighth fret, we'll go back up one more to end on our root note. Now my E minor shape is going to be with my first finger on the root note, which is on the tenth fret, sixth string. I'm gonna go 10, 11, 13 on the sixth string, 10, 12, 13, on the fifth string, 10, 12, 13 on the fourth string, 10, 12 on the uh, third string, 10, 11, 13 on the second string, 10, 11, 13 on the first string. So that is 10, 11, 13, 10, 12, 13, 10, 12, 13, 10, 12, 10, 11, 13, 10, 11, 13. Now it's going to go backward, 13, 11, 10, 13, 11, 10, 12, 10, 13, 12, 10, 13, 12, 10, 13, 11, 10. And then that's right where my root note is, so that's where that stays. Now for my D minor shape, I'm going to be moving to the key of F. So my root note is now going to be on the uh, third fret on the fourth string. That's my D minor shape. All right. And this is going to be with, uh, start out with my first finger on the root note, which is, again, now we're in the key of F. 3, 4, 6 on the 4th string, 3rd uh, fret, 5th fret, 6th fret on the 3rd string, my 2nd finger is going to go on the 2nd string, 4th fret, 6th fret, and then 2nd, 4th, 6th on the 1st string. Now I'm just going to walk my way backward on the 1st string, 6, 4, 2, on the 2nd string, 6, 4, and then on the 3rd string, 6, 5, 3, 6, 4, 3 on the 4th string. Then I'm going to go below it, I'm going to go to my 6th fret on the 5th string, 4th fret on the 5th string, 3rd fret on the 5th string, and then on the 6th string, 6, 4, 2 back up here and end on my root note. Now to walk back up, I'm going to be going on the 6th string, 2nd, 4th, 6th on the 5th string, 3rd, 4th, 6th, and then back up to my root note, which is on the 3rd fret, 4th string. Mm -hmm.